testing revealed two young condors reared by two separate mothers had only one parent. Their eggs were not fertilized by male sperm. Asexual reproduction was a key plot element in the 1993 movie Jurassic Park, as actor Jeff Goldblum pointed out. I'm simply saying that life uh, finds a way. It hit us in the face. We weren't looking for it. We didn't expect it. Genetic testing of the captive and wild population of California condors is a regular occurrence as researchers work to maintain genetic diversity. The species almost went extinct 30 years ago. The genomes of the mothers and offspring are the same, confirming the findings. It happened twice, you know, when the population was small. Will it happen again when the population gets bigger? I think that's an important question. These are the first known cases of reproduction without fertilization in California condors. It's called parthenogenesis. And it's the first time genetic testing has confirmed the phenomenon. The development is also unique because there were fertile males present, but the asexual reproduction happened anyway. Knowing that this is not like a a random individual we found. This is two individuals from two separate families so uh, that were able to uh, be generated using proteinogenesis. We might think that this is not as uncommon as we, we, we thought before. The California condor is the largest flying bird in the world with wingspans that can reach nine feet. The population shrank to 22 birds in the 1980s. There are now more than 500 living condors, both in captivity and flying free. Eric Anderson, KPBS News.